Hi guys, welcome to today's video. This will be on uh, using uh, Python modules. What are Python modules? Uh, how do you create your own Python modules? And what are the inbuilt Python modules? I'll give a short introduction on that, right? So Python modules is nothing but you have, let's say you have a huge script. And in that huge script, you are uh, basically uh, you have to write another script where there are a large portion of that code from the previous script is being reused so for that what you can do is create a module or create a common python file which has all the common functionalities defined in it right common functions defined in it that can be reused across different python scripts okay so um let's say in the last video i created this uh, function right which is a concat function okay let me come to that later so let me show you some of the and how to import modules so if you have pycharm installed you will have i think pandas as well okay i think it's not installed so what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna install a install pandas so the pip install command basically uh, downloads any module any inbuilt or externally created because a lot of people create python modules and they publish it on the python server so that's all available so the simple command is pip install the module and it will install the module see it's happening on the screen right now okay Let it install. Meanwhile, what we'll do is let me create my own um, library, right? Okay. Let's call it lib1. Okay. Inside lib1, let's say I have concat. I'm totally removing it from the script, okay? Here, I'll put it, okay. And then, let's say I want to use the concat1 function. Now, concat1 function is not available in the script. It has, it has gone to a different file, which is my library, okay? Now, simply what I have to do is, I have to say import lib one okay and then here you can say lib one dot concat and then you can run it see it's still functioning so what you basically did is you wrote the function in a different file and you are just importing that file and then you are executing it if you don't want to write this lib one dot concat every time you want to call it, what you can do is there's a different format of writing import, and that's from lib one import concat one. Okay, then you need not write this. You can simply say this, and it's still gonna function right. So these are two ways of writing import statements. So like I said there are some inbuilt uh, libraries as well for example pandas which we just installed so you saw the red line go gone away so now i can use pandas as well right so i'll sh give you a small example of how to use pandas right so let's say i want to do let's say i will go to excel and create a worksheet it's a name phone address right and then something 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 in each of the fields and then i will save it save it into uh, more locations i want to exactly save it inside my no it's it's not getting saved file save as this pc 
documents for one okay so okay so what I will do is documents with one I'm gonna drag this drag this here okay so now you have book one dot xlsx okay so what I'm going to do is I'll say uh, df equal to pd dot read underscore xl and then I'm gonna provide the path book one dot xlsx you can always shorten it okay so whenever you're referring to pd it will know that it's calling pandas because I've written import pandas as pt. So what I said is uh, just read this excel file for me. Okay, I also need to install open py excel. So instead of an excel sx, right? So, so there's another thing I want to show. So if you want to, you know, open this in file explorer, you can right click here and click on open in explorer okay so basically instead of an excel file let me save as a comma delimited file save okay so then i i'm gonna read a csv file and i'm gonna change the command to read underscore csv okay so it read it okay now if i want to print what this uh, what it read from the file I'll just say df see it printed out the output of the excel so these are how you use the import functions uh, from either inbuilt la libraries uh, that you have to install using pip install or you can create your own functions but make sure whatever libraries you create right that has a list of functions only right uh, so uh, yeah that's pretty much about python modules and libraries hope you like this video and if you have not subscribed yet please subscribe to your youtube channel thanks for watching